good morning children welcome back hope you are all fine in the previous class we studied about oceans and their characteristics in this class we will study about the importance of oceans though oceans are enormous bodies of water they provide a large number of help to the people they are an integral part of our very existence because of the vastness of ocean they absorb a lot of insulation or incoming solar radiation they absorb the heat energy of the sun and releases them and thus they helps the land cool during summer and helps the land warm during winter they directly and indirectly help to regulate the climate of an area see in the ocean there are warm currents and cold currents warm currents flow from the equator to the poles whereas cold currents move from the polar regions to the equator the wind that move along a warm current picks up moisture and this moisture as it goes up it uh, condenses and help to and uh, uh, comes down in the form of rain similarly the wind that blows along the cold current it helps to bring down the temperature of the surrounding area seas provide waterways we know uh, waterways is the cheapest means of transportation when we want to carry bulky products from one place to another we depend upon ocean route as it is the cheapest means of transport a very large number of navigation routes are there which provide which helps in the movements of millions and millions of trucks tons of cargo this ability of oceans in navigating had been explored by men from time immortal oceans are the sources of water they provide as the as an important source of water cycle in the previous class we know studied about water cycle it is because of the water cycle the water remains almost constant on the earth oceans provide an important role in this water cycle oceans are food resources we know a very large number of aquatic animals live in the oceans and we catch them and harvest them and use for our food millions of people find their livelihood as well as their food from the ocean thus economically oceans have a lot of importance in addition to provide food the sea weed a kind of plant that grows in ocean provide a lot of important products it can be converted into manure it can be converted into uh, it can be used as the raw material for a large number of organic products thus by every means oceans have a lot of economic importance 
even oil can be exported from the uh, sea basin in india we have uh, such a place which is called uh, bombay high from where petroleum is drilled oceans provide a very large number of various resources they are the uh, rich storehouses of sodium chloride magnesium chloride and potassium chloride sodium chloride is very commonly using substance we can find it at every family we call it as common salt that gives a pinch of it gives taste to food that salt is obtaining from seas and oceans oceans can be useful in generating electricity too the electricity that is obtaining from the movement of tide that is seen in the ocean is called tidal energy there are many countries which effectively make use of this tides for the generation of electricity france usa and uk are examples of such countries that makes the power of tides for making electricity already i have told you that oceans provide means of transportation though it is the cheapest means of transportation yet it provide many dangers and difficulties too many a time the ships may wreck on its voyage we have heard the disaster that was caused due to the sinking of the famous ship titanic millions and millions of what rupees worth goods have been sunk along with the ships that were wrecked in the oceans sometimes the ships may collide with icebergs icebergs are huge pieces of ice that float away from the polar regions and it moves along with the ocean current only a small portion of the icebergs may be visible and an enormous portion of it would be submerged under water the ships when it collide with this iceberg may cause their destruction that was hard that was what happened to titanic though the ships may face threats from icebergs still ocean transport is the most preferable means of transport for the movement of heavy and bulky products sometimes the ships may fall prey to the pirates pirates are sea robbers some areas some structures of the oceans are infamous for the pirate attack now the commercial vessels or merchant ships are Uh, provided protection by the navies of their own country or by the nearby countries thus the problem of pirates could be possible to lessen to a great extent so far we have studied about the importance of oceans they are very much important to us Uh, from the economic point of view as well as from the sustaining of life on earth by maintaining water cycle they regulate climate they provide food to humans 
as well as the aquatic animals they are the rich storehouses of many important resources like petroleum and common salt hope these points are clear to you if you feel any difficulty in getting any point clear feel free to contact me through the school app it's enough for today thank you